What's going on everybody? Jeremy here, that painter fella. And uh, what I'm gonna do today is actually give you just a uh, little demonstration. Everybody talks about why you shouldn't be using a desiccant system for a fresh air mask whenever you're you know, using it for a breathing apparatus. Um, why you shouldn't be using it for painting. Why, you know, if you've heard that the desiccant beads actually break down. Uh, well, I've never had that problem. Well, if you've never experienced it, you're lucky. However, it does happen. Now, the reason that it does is obviously desiccant beads, once moisture is introduced to them, they will start cracking, they will start breaking, they will start popping. That stuff eventually is gonna be pushed through and get into your air lines. Um, with most desiccant, uh, desiccant systems, they've got the oil trap, they've got a water trap, and then it goes into the desiccant system for a final dry. If those first two systems have failed, once it gets in there, your desiccant beads have already been compromised and that's gonna be going in. Now, the reason you don't wanna be breathing that, it's silica. If you know the reason you don't want to go into your paint or going through your paint gun, you're painting. It's going to have to. You're going to go into a uh, uh, basically contamination onto your surface. You're going to have to sit there and actually sand it out, and you're going to be having uh, problems. You know, if it's getting into your clear coat or anything like that, it causes a really, really big mess. Now, what I'm going to do, I just want to do a simple demonstration for you. It's it's going to be quick, simple, and easy. Let you see what I'm talking about and what others are talking about. What I have here are normal everyday desk can beads. I'm gonna put them up here in the camera, that way you can see. You know, they're completely dry as I drop some. Put them in that one, which you see. Normal desk can beads. And all I'm gonna do, I've got about an ounce of desk can beads in each. Obviously mine is just that little bit that I just dropped. Regular Dasani water. I'm gonna pour just a little bit of water into the desk can beads, let you guys see how they react. That's all I'm gonna do. Water, desk can beads. A little bit of water. Listen. Now, as your air moves through your desiccant beads, it's gonna be agitating everything, right? You hear all that popping? That's the desk and beads breaking apart. Want to add a little bit more water? A little bit more. Stir it up. See them breaking and jumping? It's as simple as that. Now granted, of course, that's a lot more water that I added in on the second go around, but you saw it and you could hear it actually sitting there breaking and popping as it was uh, as it was initially going. Again, just to show that there's nothing different, nothing that I'm doing. This is the one that I haven't done anything to. A little bit of water. And again, as it moves through the system, the air is gonna agitate everything. As the beads become saturated, they begin to break, they begin to pop, they become those little sharp, uh, sharp shards that go through everything. Simple and easy. Don't know any other way to put it.